हेलो फ्रेंड्स अ वेरी गुड मॉर्निंग टू एवरी वन दिस इज शेखर इन कॉन्टीन्यूशन विद माई प्रीवियस सेशन यूजर एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन फ्यू थिंग्स वर लेफ्ट इन द प्रीवियस सेशन सो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस एंड कंप्लीट दिस यूजर एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन पार्ट कंप्लीटली सो इन दिस सेशन वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट कमांड चेज द चेज कमांड बेसिकली विद द नेम इट सेल्फ इट्स एक्सप्लेनेटरी चेज मीन्स चेंज यूजर पासवर्ड एक्सपायरी इन्फॉर्मेशन द चेज कमांड चेंजेस द नंबर ऑफ डेज बिटवीन द पासवर्ड चेंजेस एंड द डेट ऑफ द पासवर्ड चेंज सो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस ईच एंड एवरी आस्पेक्ट ऑफ चेज कमांड इन दिस सेशन सो लेट्स मेक दिस सेशन ए प्रैक्टिकल सेशन ओके सो लेट्स मी क्रिएट अ यूजर फर्स्ट सपोज आई एम गोइंग टू क्रिएट अ यूजर यूजर एड Manish. Okay. So, how to see the complete detail of user Manish? So, this command will give you the password expiry information about user Manish. Now, you can see this a user Manish. The last password change is May twenty five. Okay. and password expiry is never and password inactive never account expiry is never and minimum number of days between password change zero we we are going to discuss each and every parameter in this session okay see uh, you can see the last password change is showing may 25 i think you must be thinking that just now you have created a user how come the last password change should showing may 25 because that user was already created i have just recreated if i am creating a new user which was not created on the server so it will show you the current day okay so this password last password change suppose i am going to change the password manish now red red whatever the password i have given okay see this the date is not correct that's why it is showing this okay so last password change means on which date i have changed my password right suppose yesterday i have changed my password okay and after one day if i will give the same command it will show the last password change was 24 okay so this way we will come to know that when the user has changed his last password okay suppose i want to set the expiry of particular user password currently it is showing never i want to set it for 10 days from now okay manish okay m is basically the number of days for the password expiration see this the user was created the user has last password change on may 25th and his password will expire on june 4 okay okay and the last thing the number of days of warning before password expiration today is say for example the last password change is today so after 10 7 days the when the user will log in to the server he will start getting a warning message warning message means he will ask a user to change his password he will give a warning message he will tell you after 3 days your password will expire okay so you can set the warning message as per the requirement if you want to set it for 5 days so you can set this as well Five. Now again, if I will give the command, 
okay see i have given the wrong command for warning this is a command capital w okay now see this after five days from last password change when a user will log in he will start getting a warning message okay so we have discussed three parameters here last password change password expiration and the number of days of warning before a password change okay what is this password inactive say for example on june 4th the user manish has not changed his password after getting repetitive warning messages this user doesn't take it seriously and he didn't change his password okay so what will happen on 5th of june once he will log into the server what will happen he won't able to log into the server server will ask to supply a old password and he is forcefully to create a new password then only he will able to log into the server right okay so on june 5th a user will log in he will ask to change his password there is no other option to get into the server say for example the particular user manish has not changed his password okay for say for example i am just discussing what is password inactive so password inactive suppose if i have set it for 5 days okay so so what will happen let me tell you let me take a okay fine chase hyphen capital i say for example i have given 5 for manish user okay clear this okay now you can see password inactive 5 days i have given so from june 4 onward when a user will when a user manish will logging to the system he is supposed to change his password otherwise he won't able to log into the server for the next 5 days he will be getting the this warning this message to change his password forcefully say for example manish user has not changed his password till june 09 okay 9th of june he has not changed his password okay so what will happen on 10th of june his account will expire then when he will log in to the server on june 10th what will happen he won't able to log in to the server because his account is expired on june 8 june 7 when when he will log in at least that time he is an option to log in to the server because he has to simply provide the old password and a new password but password he has already you know gone through 5 days for inactive and after that his account will be expire okay so we have discussed last password change when the user has changed his password password expiration warning messages and password inactive okay so what is this account expires okay first thing is password expiration and second thing is account expire if your account will expire it means uh, just like your user has been disabled from the server okay it is just like uh, you know although your user would be in the server but it is stated that your user is not existing on the server okay if you will you know talk about you know any production environment where in any company if your account has been disabled it means if you want to active your account 
you have to you know go through the various approvals they will ask you why your account has been expired what what are the reasons okay why the user has not you know follow the password policy so all these things we have to answer then only your account will be you know again enabled so you know we can also set this password expiration okay to set the password expiration capital e okay suppose i am setting it for 3 months okay so it's very simple say for example 2017 uh, 07 is your month and 31st maybe 30 and money issue oh something not control c see this now i have set the account expiration okay the account will expire on june 30 okay suppose you know i want to create a user whose password will never expire whose account will never expire and there should not be any you know minimum number of days the password change and maximum number of days between the password change okay so this also we can do it so there is a command for that very simple command you know sometimes you know uh, when we work there are such users like application users or db users which is being used by the applications and they want that particular user should be you know uh, will not follow any password policy because if the password will expire the you know whole application will be stopped so that time you know we have to make the user account which will be you know never expire so how to do this simple chase hyphen m m is for you know number of minimum days up between a password change it's very simple suppose you know manish user has changed his password today and i have set minimum number of days for 2 days so manish user won't able to change his password for the next 2 days if i have set it for 5 days so he has to keep the same password for the next 5 days then only he will able to to change his password okay this way i have given m and capital m is for the maximum number of days with the name it's understood maximum number of days between the password change Five nines hyphen capital I is for inactive. If I am giving minus one, it means never. Capital E minus one never. And Manish. Okay, some error. Let's see what's the error. I haven't specify any value for M. Okay. Clear. And now you can see. money user is you know free from any password expiry his account will never expire his password will never expire okay you know sometimes you know uh, unix admin has received a password reset tickets so once you will change this password you want the particular user once login to the server he is forcefully to ask to change his password say for example there is a manish user which is a dba user and as a unix admin i have reset his password say for example i have reset his password to test but i want manish when he logs log into the server he is forcefully to ask to change his password so in that case i have given this okay so once manish will log in to the system duplicate session manish what about the password now you can see manish can log in to the system with his old password okay but after specifying his current password he is supposed to give a new password okay so 
this good for manish because unix admin knows his password what is the need of unix admin should know his password okay so we usually do such type of task so i believe we have learn this chase command which is a very useful command and we have discussed each and all parameters what all with chase command right guys so i think that's enough for this session thanks we'll come up with more videos more ideas thanks bye bye take care